If you're brand new to Tarkov or even a veteran with thousands of hours, you've probably noticed that there are hundreds if not thousands of items in Escape from Tarkov. And one of the biggest learning curves of this game is simply understanding what items are worth taking out of raid to maximize your profit. Now I've already made a video covering the items most people had no idea were valuable, but today I'm going to be showing you guys 8 best in slot money making items that you can find everywhere. Did you guys know that 98% of you that watch my videos are not subscribed? That's insane. Do me a favor, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and you might as well turn on notifications while you're at it. Just make sure you don't miss out on any future videos. That's all I'm asking. All right, so jumping straight into this video today, we're going to be talking about some items that are the best in slot money makers. We already made a video showing you guys some lesser known things that will make you a ton of money. But this time we're going to be talking about items that will make you a ton of money that you can find absolutely everywhere. Now, obviously, this is going to be in my personal experience. These are items that I find regularly. A lot of you might disagree with that, but that's just how it is for me. So we've got eight different items and these are in no particular order and first up on the list is going to be a can of thermite now i find these things quite often on interchange lighthouse various different places i wouldn't say that they're extremely common but they are pretty common now unfortunately at this point in the wipe prices on a lot of things that used to be expensive are now going down and then in some cases prices on things that were really cheap are starting to go up so keep in mind that prices are going to depend on what point of the wipe we're at so thermites right now are selling for around 90 to 100k they take up one slot so that's a huge item to pick up and in my opinion if you find one of these things throw it in your gamma container because you can use it for an ammo box trade if you happen to die but thermite is always going to be one of those things that you want to pick up no matter what next up on the the list is going to be golden star lip balm and this is obviously a painkiller now these things beginning of wipe are super super cheap i believe at the beginning of this wipe i want to say they were around 20k 20 30k something like that but as the wipe goes on these things get more and more expensive i saw them sitting at like 150k the other day right now they are sitting around anywhere between 100 and 120k but these are going to be easily found in med spawn places one of the top places that i typically find find these is on woods either at the USEC camp or at the scav compound on the other side of the map i find these things all day long so if you know a good place to loot medical items chances are you're gonna find golden stars pretty frequently another good place is obviously the resort on shoreline there's a ton of med spawns in there if you're the kind of guy that likes to run shoreline you're gonna find a lot of golden stars so if you find one of these things definitely take it out of raid with you throw it up on the fleet make some money i believe they get super expensive because of the propodol craft in the hideout but i'm not 100 percent sure it's also a very good painkiller people love using this one but at this point with the changes to painkillers this wipe i don't even really use golden star anymore to be honest with you next up is going to be sugar this should be a no-brainer for a lot of people most people at this point know if you see a sugar you probably want to pick it up i always throw these things in my gamma just because i make moonshine so if i die i'll get out with it but sugars right now are sitting around 50k at one point in the wipe they were all the way up to 70 but as i said before the later in the wipe you get the cheaper stuff becomes so if you see sugars out there definitely pick them up they're a one slot item of course it is worth picking up next up is going to be the iridium military thermal vision module this is one that a lot of people are going to disagree with me on saying that's not very common you don't really see those things very often and i get it but as a person who plays a lot of reserve i see these things a ton not only that they're also on streets a lot i find them pretty common there and these are definitely an item that you want to pick up it's a one slot item of course and they're selling right now for around 80k another good place to find them is obviously going to be lighthouse pretty much all these items you're going to be able to find on any map but other maps are going to be better for specific things moving on we have the military power filter now this one might be the cheapest per slot item that we look at today i'm not really sure again i find these things all all over reserve because i play a ton of it but you can also find them streets lighthouse tons of other maps 
they are pretty common and i do find them quite frequently again another one slot item worth about 40k i believe at one point these things were worth upwards of 100,000 early wipe because you need them for the hideout so obviously if you find any kind of military item you probably want to pick it up but the power filter is a good one slot item that you should pick up every time you see it next up on the list is going to be the green lithium battery now i do remember early wipe these things were selling for absolutely nothing around 10 to 15k but now obviously with the bitcoin barter and there may be something else that you need these for in a barter i'm not really sure these things have absolutely skyrocketed usually sit between 70 and 80k but they can go even higher of course with the price of bitcoin going up and up and up these are going to go up as well but i do remember early wipes seeing a ton of these things i picked up a few realized they were only selling for like 15k and i just stopped picking them up i'm really regretting that right now but this is one of those things if you see it early wipe or at any point in the wipe go ahead and pick it up you might have to save them for a little bit but it's totally worth it next up on the list is going to be the water filter let me go ahead and change this to 100 percent real quick because people are selling them for super low i'm gonna snag that real quick i missed it that sucks anyways the water filter this is probably my favorite item on the list for whatever reason i just get super excited when i find one of these in raid i just love picking them up i don't know what it is about it but the water filter they typically sell around 100k depending on the point of the wipe i've seen these things as high as 130k and of of course if you watch my video on how to be successful early wipe and make a ton of money the water filter is a big part of that so again early wipe pick these things up save them you're gonna need them always 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 take water filters they are huge and they are worth a ton of money being a two slot item that means they're worth about 50k per slot so water filters definitely one of my favorite items to find and pick up and last on the list is going to be the ibuprofen painkillers now the reason why this is on the list is because i went to get some of these the other day to do the propodol craft and they were selling for like 80 or 90k and i was like that's insane let me go ahead and put it on my list so i can make this video in the future and then of course about five days later i go to make the video now they're sitting around 40k but 40k is still not bad i would say ibuprofen is way more common than golden star and i find these things absolutely everywhere and usually early wipe i'll pick up a ton of them throw them in a med case and just hold on to them for later i personally don't like using ibuprofen at this point in the wipe i use propodol only for a painkiller but they are very very common and i highly recommend grabbing them and selling them on the flea market 40k for a one slot item not too bad and just as a little bonus let's say you went into raid filled your backpack up with all eight of the items that i mentioned in this video this is how much space it would take up and you would be looking at roughly 600k worth of profit just off of these items now the best in slot money making items is kind of the key point here these are obviously going to be items that take up the least amount of space for the most amount of money without getting into the no-brainers like lead x's and bitcoins and stuff like that these are some more popular items that people should know about and these are going to be items that you will typically be able to find very often in raid so that's going to be it for this video hopefully you guys enjoyed hopefully you learned something if you guys have any more examples of one slot or two slot items that are worth a ton of money and are worth picking up be sure to leave it down in the comments below but other than that i'll see you guys in the next video